Hi everybody, my name is Lorca Paris and I'm a theater director and I'm the artistic director of Multi Stages, which is a theater company here in New York that I founded in 1997. And I'm also the co-president of the League of Professional Theater Women, which is an important organization that advocates for parity in the industry. Uh, so to tell you a little bit about myself, other than my professional credits, uh, I started out when I was young. I actually grew up in a family of artists. My mother is a poet, my father is a music conductor, and my grandmother is an actress and a dancer, and turned to writing later in her career. And so I kind of fell right into it. You know, uh, I was playing piano as a kid. I was taking ballet and dance and painting classes and sort of everything you can imagine. And I was in a lot of operas as a child uh, with my dad conducting. And uh, one of them, it was kind of fun. I played in Tosca, I played the boy, the shepherd boy. They put my hair in a braid or something. And I went out as a boy at the age of 10. Um, and so I had a, I sort of grew into the career and I continued studying. I was interested in acting more so than anything else at the time. And I studied at Strasbourg in the Young Actors Program. I later went and studied there uh, professionally after I graduated from college. And I started acting in New York City um, and I was working all around the country and uh, just had quite a busy career. Well, when I was in my mid-30s, I decided I wanted to make a change. Uh, the looming 40s was in front of me. I was kind of nervous about that. So I thought, well, I studied directing and I had actually observed a lot of directors when I worked at different internships uh, throughout the country uh, in, my, in my college days. So I started directing and little by little I really got into it and uh, I decided to start a theater company. So we are now in our 14th year, almost 15th year of multi-stages and it has a very specific mission to me. Um, all this is just sort of to give you an idea of where you might go with your career. You never know where one track will take you. It's a very exciting journey that I've been on for 15 years. Uh, some of the ideas that I might be able to impart to you are in education. I think that's a huge, huge advantage to all of us. And I mentioned a minute ago that I had done internships and I really learned on the job if you will. I mean, I think acting classes are terrific. I actually teach them. Uh, I teach at NYU and at Strasbourg, so I'm all about acting and uh, auditioning and all of that important, you know, element. But I also think interning and getting to meet people and networking and really uh, honing in, you know, your craft with other people I think is extremely important. And we find that the networking actually comes back around because I still know people that I met at Missouri Repertory when I was 17 and I actually just directed uh, Lynn Cohen, who's an actress that I sat next to at the dressing table when I was 19 years old. So when I first started out, I painted sets and I did, you know, lots of grunt work. Um, but I also sat in and observed amazing directors and playwrights and actors, and, and I really learned a tremendous amount from that. And you never know where you're going to go in your life. So I definitely think college is a, a great avenue. I do encourage everybody to go to college if you can. Um, and it's affordable, we find ways to do it. And uh, other than education, I think interning, networking, just meeting people. And the last bit of advice that I'm going to give you is something that I learned a little bit later in life. Don't be afraid to ask for help. I think it's really important. Um, I found myself kind of feeling a little too proud or humbled to ask anybody for help, but now I'm very happy giving back. And so if I'm giving back, I'm sure other people are happy to give back too. So my advice is if you meet somebody who's in the industry, um, you know, ask them if you can take them for coffee or sit down and have lunch and just chat a little bit. Ask if they know anyone who can help you or could they look at your resume. You know, just be friendly and nice and of course write a thank you letter afterwards. Uh, manners are important. Don't do everything by email. Call people up on the phone. Be uh, personal and uh, fabulous things will happen for you. <laughs>